had a really long day because we had to make sure everything was done because we are packing and had to make sure we had all our toiletries and travel size things and it was a day it was a day but it's fine we're back we're good we're ready to go we're gonna do some skincare um and i'm gonna do a little q and a with you guys if you want to be included in the next q a just be sure to go on my instagram at the life of danielle j on instagram and let's get started so the first question is what's something you're proud of in 2021 all right something i'm proud of i would say the thing i'm proud of from 2021 is me graduating I like a band they've been trying hard just to make us all finish i suggest you put a flag on a whole nother planet okay she's a graduate okay she has a master's degree a bachelor's degree honey okay and that master's was a 4.0 did you hear that let me say it one more time. It was a 4.0. That means no mistakes. A's all across the board. Did I have an unbelievable amount of anxiety and stress? Yes. But did I get the 4.0? Also, yes. I know the degree was worth it. Was the stress worth it? Uh, probably not. I did get shingles. I think there was a question in here that was like, what was like the low light of 2021? I got shingles. Like a gr I I am young and I got shingles. Like I was shooketh to the core. Let me tell you something. That was the most bizarre, bizarre experience I've ever had in my entire life. Okay, next question. Something exciting that happened in 2021. Well, something very exciting is about to happen, <laughs> which you guys will see soon. Um, but something exciting that happened. PR, like I got a PR package, like in like a real life influencer, which I am. Hey, how are you? Welcome to the Life Daniel James channel. Starbucks, like the corporation, and I'm on their page. Like I, like I'm on. Like if you go to TikTok and then go to Starbucks, you'll see. Like, let's get into it. Love a good skin roller moment. We love a good skin roller moment, okay? You don't have one, you need to get one. You need to get one right now. I'm telling you, will it change your life? Depending on what your definition of changing your life means, but it may, it may. You've got plans for 2022, love your reels. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. It literally makes my day when you guys say that like you like my content because I put a lot um I put a lot of work into them and it just makes me so excited that like you guys see it and you guys see the value in it and I'm not just like doing this as like a little hobby like I'm really trying to make this a career. Speaking of career, I got reached out to by a brand to do a, uh, a brand deal for them on TikTok. And that was really cool because usually as an influencer, like the things you don't see, like even as someone on a micro level like me, the thing uh, you don't see, oh, I'm using my astringent. Oh, I should have been walking you guys through this, my bad. So <laughs> to start, I used my CeraVe Foaming Facial Cleanser. Um, and after that, I used my roller, as you saw, and now I'm using my astringent. Any works. Um, um, but the thing about influencing is like a lot of the times you're reaching out to brands to work with them and to, you know, pitch yourself. And like, that's the thing that people don't really see that much. They just see like the PR packages and the trips and the pretty photos and the videos and it's like but if you're trying to make this an actual like business um you have to put a lot of work in and i think that's the part that people don't really know or they don't realize but that's neither here nor there so a brand reached out to me and it was very exciting um and they were very professional sent over the contract really quickly sent over the payment <laughs> very quickly um so that's good uh, so I would say things coming in the new year, I booked a role. I booked two. Wow. I booked two roles. Um, wow. I booked two roles that are starting, um, in January and it's, it's wild. Cause it's like, what? 
<laughs> anyway, sometimes I, when I think about what I've done, it's easier for me to acknowledge what I've accomplished, but I'm very, very hard on myself and that's kind of a double-edged sword. It definitely keeps me moving, it keeps me progressing, it keeps me like, you know, getting to the next thing, but it also is very, very tiring. So um, I think I just had a moment just now realizing like I booked two roles, I have a brand deal, like, and basically what I'm, all that to say, thank you for saying you like my reels and big things are coming and I'm just, very very excited i hate the fact that i'm like mm -hmm, i can't tell you too many details i'm under contract <laughs> but i am so i can't <laughs> next up we've got my nighttime uh cerave facial moisturizing lotion this is really really good i love it it is so nice and refreshing on the skin and also i've got my retinol it is never too early to start caring about your skin biggest pet peeve when people say that they're gonna do something and then they don't do it just don't say you're gonna do it just don't do that also my time don't waste my time i guess it's basically this first thing but don't waste my time that's where it really boils down to because i value my time very much i'm a very busy woman very busy you know business boss woman i don't have time for you to waste mine okay how did it feel to graduate amazing amazing how many times do you go to starbucks in a week I mean, quite a lot. I'm not gonna lie. I go often, but it could be worse. It could be worse. Oh, what is a goal for 2022? A goal? Ooh, okay. Uh, well, you know, I'm gonna do a vision board. I do a vision board every single year. I love them because it creates a physical, tangible thing that encapsulates everything that you want to accomplish in a year and i don't know about anybody else but for me specifically it's really helpful um because i'm so hard on myself it's easier for me to acknowledge what i've accomplished if i see it on a big poster board like i wanted to accomplish this thing so like i remember on my vision board i had like i wanted an unboxing um i wanted uh, a sponsorship i wanted to graduate i wanted clear skin and bigger checks <laughs> a bunch of stuff and i checked off oh i wanted a, a job got those like i just wanted so many things and i really got them and i don't think that there's like magic in the paper per se but i do think there is something magical about the fact that when you have a visual representation of what you want and you can see your goals laid out for you that it just does something for you because i know people do like virtual boards or whatever virtual inspo like on their phone and stuff like that and that works for some people but i'm a more tactile person so i like when I write down my goals. I like when I like can see it and touch it and look at it and so yeah. The goals I have, I guess I could put in this video, one of the goals I want to make sure that I am taking care of my hair um, because I love a good Beyonce moment. Um, but I've been trying really hard ever since quarantine to take care of my hair underneath it and that means me not touching it. Just investing in a professional with a degree, so. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. And it's my hair has been thriving ever since. Okay. Everybody's got their ministry. That is not mine. And that's fine. That's fine. I'm not meant to do that. I'm meant to sit in a chair, have someone else do it and me go on my phone. Like that's what I'm meant to do. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm saying that lane. I'm saying that lane. I'm going to be planning a wedding. <laughs> so planning a wedding with as little stress as possible making sure i'm in the best physique for that wedding and that dress in that moment um because i only plan to do this once and then i have some goals i want my channel to grow i want my followings to grow i want my brand deals and partnerships and everything to continue to grow and prosper and I'm just really, really proud of myself um, from where I was last year and where I am now. So like I can put up on the screen, like on Instagram where I was last year and where I am right now and my views last year and my views right now. 
So very exciting. And I just can't wait to take you guys along for the journey. And thank you to all the people who have been supporting me since Taylor Swift reaction videos. Please know that you are valued and loved and I appreciate you so, 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 so much. Thanks. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please do not forget to like the video. It really does help me and make sure that you leave a comment down below. Check out my socials. It is at the Life of Daniel James on Instagram and TikTok. And I'll see all you lovely, lovely, beautiful, beautiful people next time with another video. Bye guys. <laughs>